Hello, Shmai. Well, I was away from America for three months, and whilst I was away, a bunch of records arrived for me that I had ordered. I've got about six records, I think, to go through here. So yeah, uh, stick around, like, comment, subscribe, and yeah, hope you enjoy. first one um, is actually my first 10 inch record, it's Kota the Friend and it is Lyrics to Go Volume 3, yeah Volume 3. Uh, this came from like a German website, I ordered this before I went away, it's a very cool looking orange kind of like sun set colours I would say, you know orange and yellowy kind of thing. Yeah, really cool. The next few um, are all from VMP, so Vinyl Me Please, which is like a subscription service. So first off, it was Biggie Smalls, uh, Ready to Die. I've got to open up this record, but I haven't actually opened this yet. I've been waiting. I've got this crown. Very cool. VMP pressings, I mean, they're just so beautiful. Splatter, you can you never know what you're gonna get with a splatter record. Sometimes they're incredible, other times they're a bit underwhelming, but that one is good. Nice. Happy with that. Oh, I can't wait to listen to this. That was actually the VMP hip hop album of the month when I first found out about Buy Me Please. So it's yeah, I'm happy to have it now, own it. So the next one is the game documentary. When I saw this was going to be one, I instantly jumped on it. Uh, I've wanted this on vinyl, um, but it's very hard to come by on regular. And as I said, VMP always do a really good job when it comes to pressings. It's a gatefold. So this one opens up. Back a bit again is foiled. Yeah, actually it's quite cool. It's like the car. Like the car rims. Not the last VMP I'm gonna show, but Grave Diggers. I actually still haven't listened to this album. Such a shiny album. And oh my, how cool that looks. That is sick. So another record that arrived, this actually I was going to pick it up in America and I missed it, it sold out whilst I was over there um, and then I was looking on eBay to try and order it over there and I actually found out, oh actually I could get it just delivered to the UK for the same price I'd pick it up in America and I don't have to lug it back with me so I just ordered it whilst I was over there. Red Hot Chili Peppers by the way on purple vinyl. This is easily my favourite Red Hot Chili Peppers album. It's so good. Dost is definitely my favourite song and it's this lovely purple Chili Peppers and this looks really cool if you actually invert the colours on it. Um, I'll put up like a little demonstration thing of what it looks like when you invert the colours on these things. So the next one I've got to give a shout out to somebody so whenever I go to like HMV, queue up record store day queue up. There's this guy Dave who is always there as well looking to get records. He's always like one of the first people in the queue and actually for the last record store day we were talking. He was number one in the queue. I think I was number three and me and another dude in the queue were talking about how we're not going to be there for the second drop for record store day and he very kindly said well I know you guys would have been queuing up for the drop if you were here. So I have no problem with getting you guys what it is that you need if you want me to. And I took him up in his offer and the Maccabees. It's the only thing I wanted for the second drop of Record Store Day. Colour it in, it's on white vinyl. Um, I haven't opened it yet, um, I'm going to open it up a bit later on. And yeah, this is a quality album. Um, very hard to find on vinyl. I think they made a thousand copies of this previously 
and they did 1,500 copies this time for Record Store Day. Um, so yeah, just mad, mad happy that I can own this. Um, yeah, massive thank you, Dave, for that. And the last record, I've only been listening to this group recently, but this is already probably like one of my favourite albums now. Um, and it's another Vinyl Me Please pressing, and it's the only one that isn't hip hop. This is in the classics, uh, not classics, essential section. Um, so this is Bright Eyes. This is an insanely good album. This thing here, there's the back, the front. It just looks, everything about it is just amazing. I'm wide awake, it's morning. Like, Bright Eyes, they, they are just the epitome of just the perfect blend of, I would say, poetry and music. It, they are insane. And as soon as I saw that this was going to be pressed for VMP, I was just ecstatic. Like, look at this. It's like a smoky, red, pressing kind of suits that little red sewed thing on the cover. I am over the moon with it. Because I've got my two favourite albums now from Bright Eyes on vinyl. So I've got this one and then the other one is Lifted. Um, so yeah, like that's everything that I picked up. Well, everything that got picked up for me uh, whilst I was away in America. Um, oh, also, actually, I did get. Oh, I ordered this ages ago. It is a. I don't know if you see that. Death Race for Love, Juice World 999. It's got. Death Race for Love 999 on the other sleeve. I just love this thing. It's so comfortable. Are you not sent? Because I've had so much problems with the 999 Juice World store. It's ridiculous now. But yeah, that's everything that um, I got whilst I was away in America. Yeah, thank you for watching. Again, if you can, drop us a like, comment and subscribe. And yeah, thanks for watching.